Right, we're here for a beer o'clock review. Uh, we've got a beer and we've got lots of gear. And you can tell we're excited about the snowstorm that's coming. Let's start with beer. Yeah, beer, we're doing a classic today. Spates, Old Dark. Old Dark. No. Old Dark old nearly dark. stole me. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> and it is getting darker and darker out there. Mm. So there it is, that's our beer. Enjoying that this afternoon. So a quick look at some of the gear. We've got some snowshoes, we've got some shovels. Um, I'll just talk about snowshoes for a minute. Just a quick overview of things you can look look for when you're buying a pair. Yes. And that's um, you know how aggressive they are underneath. If you look at some of these, you've got lots of teeth. So some people actually might not really even know what a snowshoe is, Dan, because it's not a hugely common sport in New Zealand. So basically, it gives you lift on the snow, stops you from post hauling every time you're walking along, sinking in. And this just spreads your weight a little bit mm -hmm. and keeps you higher in the snow. Save the step plug. Exactly. Now, they also kind of work uh, like crampons almost as well. So there are aggressive pairs and less aggressive pairs. And if you look at this one, it's fairly aggressive. You've got uh, all these teeth along the side and across the bottom. That's going to stop you from sliding down the hill that way mm -hmm. and from going down the hill that awesome. way. Awesome. You know, there's lots of different ways that they work in terms of bindings, but basically you can strap your boot in and you're lifting and walking as you go. Any particular style of boot or footwear? Yeah, pretty much any any heavy duty boot will will, will be good to wear. A heavy um, duty boot. It doesn't cool. have to be heavy duty just to get out and have some fun. Yeah. One mm. other thing you might get is <laughs> yeah, <laughs> classic. Is you've got uh, a lift here, so that will actually, if you've got up steep stuff, uh, you can lift that up. So your, your oh, yeah. bed is um, not sinking down mm -hmm. every, all the way to the bottom. It just makes it easier for climbing really steep stuff. Where like that's a simpler pair, um, doesn't have that cool. option. Yeah. So that's just, just a quick over of some of the features. Uh, we've got them for sale and we've got all of, all of this is actually in our high range, um, even down to the little kitty ones. Oh, fantastic. So there we go. Quick overview. Right. And Yana. For those of you keen to get out, make the most of the high, oh, I think I saw 170 centimetres forecast, Canterbury High Country. Be careful. No. Be careful. Watch watch out for the avalanche, avalanche advisory and stuff, but must have for those of you wanting to get out there skiing before the ski fields open. We've got a fantastic range of snow shovels. So make sure you've got, it, got out there with your transceiver, probe, Buddy, it's important to be out there with a friend and shovels. And experience. And experience. Yes. Please, please be safe. <laughs> we've got Salewa, we've got uh, Order Box, we've got BCA, so there's a good range there. So be safe this weekend. Have fun in the snow. See ya.